Okay, sportsmen, so I've disconnected the um, bubbler there and uh, that's the intake for the engine and I've connected it to a HHO meter there just a volumetric measure of uh, one litre and those comes in just going to fill that up and I'm going to time it here with this uh, watch and uh, there's the uh, control panel again that we've seen before cells are there, not really hot yet not doing anything at the moment everything's off so when the clock is on a set time that may get the uh, 45 mark there and then switch to high and measure how long it takes for the litre of HHA gas to be generated ok, uh, not started yet and the clock's approaching uh, so I'm going to start right there on zero and right about now there we are, I'm drawing, oh it's uh, pretty good, over 50 amps, just over 50 and go generating quite nicely volumetric device coming up and up in the bottom right there um, comes to the top of the water level, and that's time up. We're up to uh, 30 seconds, just about there, and that's it. Just under 40 seconds, probably 35 seconds for a litre of HHO gas. Let's just get that set for another test. do these two-handed jobs holding the camera and no this system didn't cost 500 it didn't cost a thousand dollars it's probably cost about fifty dollars to make this system so all it needs is a bit of uh, time and effort on the home handyman's uh, time we'll just connect the engine back in now of the HHO meter proves the point 30 to 35 seconds per litre with these two cells generating away at 50 amps you can see the production there is pretty good what I'd like to do is have uh, maybe four of these cells for about um, 4 litres per minute, I reckon. Would be a good improvement for uh, performance of any motor, 4 litres per minute. So keep going with your systems, and we'll catch you later.